things pro wrote at school I certainly did and when I moved from infants into junior which was a different school um, there was a huge focus on times tables this is Toby by the way isn't he beautiful I have three I did have four but I had three I've got three now and they used to go to nursery each each tour she used to go to a different nursery at one point so the children had them during the day I'm going to tell you about Toby. But pro rote learning, I didn't understand what times tables were. But everybody was obsessed with times tables when I was at infant school. The teacher, um, Mrs Browning, I think her name was, had a horrible game where if you didn't answer the question right, you had to stand on the chair. And if you didn't answer it again, you had to stand on the table. And if you got one right, you were allowed to return to the chair. Well, I was always at the top on the table. And at home, I had to answer questions randomly for, from my dad on times tables. Didn't understand what they were. Isn't it important in early years that we make sure children have a basic understanding of things? And pro rote learning has never been my thing. Anyway, I have a sister. She's younger than me. She's four years younger. And... Um, she had the same offer. Answer 20 questions correctly. Random questions on your times table, says my dad, and I will buy you a tortoise. Well, I never got my tortoise. I did get 19 right, and then he asked me what 11 11s were. I confess, I still don't know what my, my tables are. I do understand what they are now, but I didn't understand back then. And I have a calculator. <laughs> and I now have three tortoises. <laughs> um, and I love them. But practically, you know, helping children understand concepts is really important. And we have to do that through play, don't we? Oh, 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 oh,